डियर स्टूडेंट्स गत का जो दुईट भिड अपलोड करते तुम्हें देखि थो गोटे भिड पंद्रह मिनिट्रे सब जाक प्रोज रोकाबुलरी आ लांगुएज डिस्कसन कर बहुत भल भाव में तुम्हें से भिड निश्चय देखि थो जो देखने डिस्क्रिप्सन बक्स में लिंक अच्छी आउ गए भिड से पंद्रह मिनिट्रे सब जाक पोएट्री पांच जाक पोएट्री आम पंद्रह मिनिट डिस्कसन कर तार लिंक डिस्क्रिप्सन बक्स में दिखाई तुम्हें चाहिए से भिडे देखी पार ये भिडे तुम सब जाक प्रोज पांच जाक प्रोज रू क्वेश्चन आंसर डिस्कसन करदे पढ़ीदे शीघ्र शीघ्र तुम तक शुणी नब भिडी को लास्ट पर्यटन देख पांच प्रोज रू पांच मार्क आम एक्जाम आसोर कहते भिड को लास्ट पर्यटन देखा पड़ा फास्ट आम देखा एलडर टू गड क्वेश्चन मुझे पढ़ी दूसरी तार पीडीएफ तुम्हें से प्ले लिस्ट प्रो सेक्शन रू पार जो भिड थमेल देखिए तुम जो भिड दरकार तुम्हें पार तेणु भिड स्टार्ट फास्ट हूँ एलडर टू गड क्वेश्चन पढ़ी दूसरी शीघ्र शीघ्र तेनालीरिक ना नॉर्थ ईस्ट डायरेक्शन नॉर्थ ईस्ट डायरेक्शन ना वी आर रियली गोइंग टू गेट सम वाटर हु सेड दिस लेंचो सेड दिस हु सेड दिस लेंचो सेड दिस व्हाट वाज लेंचो स्वाइप डूइंग देन लेंचो स्वाइप वाज प्रिपेयरिंग सफर एस यू डबल पी ईआर व्हाट डिड द ओमैन रिप्लाई टू लेंचोस प्रेडिक्शन ऑफ रेन इन रिप्लाई टू लेंचोस प्रेडिक्शन ऑफ रेन द ओमैन सेड यस गॉड विलिंग यस गॉड विलिंग बोली ओमैन कहतला हु वी आर वर्किंग इन द फील्ड्स व्हेन इट स्टार्टेड रेनिंग द ओल्डर बॉयज वी आर वर्किंग इन द Field when it started raining. What were the smaller boys doing when the woman called uh, them for dinner? The smaller boys were playing near the house when the woman called them for dinner. Who predicted heavy rains? Lencho predicted heavy rains. What could be seen approaching in the northeast? Huge mountains of clouds could be seen approaching in the northeast. What was fresh and sweet when it began to rain? The air was fresh and sweet when it began to rain. Why did Lencho go out when it rained? When it rained, let's go wait out to have important question to have the pleasure of feeling the rain on his body. What did uh, let's go say about the raindrops? Let's go say that the raindrops we are new coins. What according to let's go we are ten cent pieces. According to let's go the big drops of rain we are ten cent pieces, ten cent coins. Sorry, ten cent coins. So I go study. So let's study. So let's study. So let's study. How did the hail change? The hail changed into very large hailstones with a strong wind. Rain changed into very large hailstones with a strong wind. What truly resembled silver coins? The hailstones truly resembled silver coins. Why did Lencho children uh, run out? Lencho children ran out to collect the frozen pearls. To run out the frozen to collect the frozen pearls. How long did the hailstorm continue? The hailstorm continued for an hour. Why did the hail rain on? The hail rained on the house, the garden, the hillside, the cornfield, on the whole valley. Why were the field white uh, after the hailstorm? After the hailstorm. The field was white, as if covered with the salt. As if covered with the salt. That means, what does uh, what does not leaf remain on the trees mean? That means the trees lost all their leaves. What did Lencho say to his son standing in the middle of the field? Standing in the middle of the field, Lencho said to his son that a plague of locusts would have saved more than the hailstorm. All our work for nothing. What does this statement mean? I mean, what? All our work for nothing means their hard work turned fruitless. Their hard work turns fruitless. Who did Lencho have faith in? Very important question. Lencho had great faith in God. In God. What did Lencho tell his family after the hailstorm? After his after the hailstorm, Lencho had told his family, "No one dies of hunger." What did Lencho think all through the night? All through the night, Lencho thought of only one of the help of God. Important question. Man, what is it? Lencho was an ox of a man. That means Lencho was a hardworking farmer and he was working like an animal in the fields. So, that is important question. It was nothing less than letter to God. What does this line mean? This line means it was a letter to God only. It was a letter to God only. Next, where did Lencho drop the letter? Lencho dropped the letter in the mailbox of a post at a post office. How many pesos did Lencho need from God? कितने पैसे चाहूँ तलाशे? ना a hundred pesos. So how many pesos? What did Lencho write in his first letter to God? Lencho wrote. A letter asking for a hundred pesos in order to sow his field again and to live until the crop came because the hailstorm had destroyed his corn field. Man, which was? That's right. What did Lencho write? The envelope Lencho wrote to God on the envelope. Who read uh, the letter first? Can you see the postman? Man, which was the postman? Read the letter first. 
हुआ जो फैट एंड एमिबल फेलो द पोस्टमास्टर वाज ए फैट एंड एमिबल फेलो मन रखिबा बा व्हाट टाइप ऑफ द पर्सन वाज द पोस्टमास्टर द पोस्टमास्टर वाज ए फैट एंड एमिबल फेलो हुई सोर्सेस डिड द पोस्टमास्टर अरेंज द मनी फ्रॉम कुट मनी अरेंज करता द पोस्टमास्टर अरेंज द मनी फ्रॉम हिज सैलरी हिज एम्प्लॉइज एंड हिज फ्रेंड्स जो सैलरी रुकी छे और एम्प्लॉइज मन रुकी छे त संग मन रुकी छे फ्रॉम हिज सैलरी हिज एम्प्लॉइज एंड हिज फ्रेंड्स हाउ मच मनी वाज द पोस्टमास्टर एबल टू सेंड टू लेंचल केते पेसो एबल करथला से संग्रह करथला द पोस्टमास्टर वाज एबल टू सेंड ए लिटिल मोर देन हाफ द मनी लेंचो दैट इज 70 पेसोज हु हैंडेड द लेटर टू लेंचो द पोस्टमैन हैंडेड द लेटर टू लेंचो वेयर डिड द वेयर डिड लेंचो राइट द सेकंड लेटर टू गॉड लेंचो रोड द सेकंड लेटर टू गॉड एट द पोस्ट ऑफिस विंडो when did the postmaster open the letter the postmaster opened the letter at the moment the letter fell to the mailbox who said i wish i had the faith of the man eta ki koitla i wish i had the faith of the man the postmaster said this who went to the mailbox to read second letter to god the postmaster went to uh, the mailbox to read second letter to god how did the uh, how did lencho react on seeing the money lencho so important question lencho so not the slightest surprise on seeing the money What was Lencho's reaction when he counted the money? Lencho became angry. Point question: Lencho became angry when he counted the money. On which day did Lencho came a bit earlier than usual to ask if there was a letter for him? The following Sunday. Answer was the following Sunday. What did Lencho request God in his second letter? By his last letter, Lencho requested God to send him the rest of the money. He also asked not to send to the mail because the post office employees a bunch of where a bunch of crooks. Remember Lencho said that a bunch of crooks will go there. The post office employees. तले इतला लेटर टू गॉड रो क्वेश्चन बता नामे ट्रिस्ट विथ डेस्टिनी चैप्टर रो किछि क्वेश्चन डिस्कशन कर दो सब क्वेश्चन आमे चैप्टर नाम छ ट्रिस्ट डेस्टिनी ट्रिस्ट डेस्टिनी इज द फुल टेक्स्ट ऑफ द स्पीच डेलीवर्ड बाय डैश जवाहरलाल नेहरू द स्पीच ट्रिस्ट टू डेस्टिनी वाज डेलीवर्ड इन द डैश कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट असेंबली द स्पीच ट्रिस्ट डेस्टिनी वाज डेलीवर्ड ऑन द बिनाइट ऑफ डैश अगस्ट 14 नवंबर 1947 लॉन्ग इयर्स एगो इंडिया मेड इट ट्रिस्ट टू डैश डेस्टिनी पिलन द ब्लैंक्स पढेम किंतु मु डिस्कशन कर दो जेतु एटा हार्ड चैप्टर अछि According to Nehru, Indians should redeem their pledge dash very substantially. At the dash of the midnight, India will have life and freedom. At the stroke of the midnight, at the stroke of the midnight hour, India will have to dash life and freedom. The achievement of dash is a rare moment. The achievement of freedom, the achievement of freedom comes but dash in history, rarely in history. After a long time, the soul of a nation long suppressed finds dash utterance. According to Nehru, the pledge of dedication is not only to solve India but also to the dash larger cause of humanity. At the dawn of history, India started on dash her unending quest. The history of ancient India is filled with dash, success and other success and failures. Though uh, good and ill person alike, India has never lost dash. The sight of that quest, in spite of success and failure, India has forgotten the dash, her ideals. Nehru says that we end uh, we end today a period of dash misfortunes. The dash we celebrate today is what a step. The achievement, the achievement we celebrate today is what a dash step. Nehru considers freedom as a step. Uh, towards us greater dreams and achievements nehru says that greater dreams and achievements that dash us await us nehru urges india to accept the dash of the future challenges of the future nehru says that we must be dash enough and dash enough to grasp the opportunity and accept the challenges of the future brave wise freedom and power bring dash responsibility dash bring responsibility freedom and power the assembly is a dash body sovereign body The assembly is a sovereign body represented by the sovereign people of India. Before the birth of freedom, we have endured dash all the pains of labor. Before uh, before the birth of freedom, we have endured all the pains of labor, and our hearts are heavy with dash memory of this sorrow. According to Nehru, dash is over. The future, the past is over. Sorry, the past is over. It is the dash that becomes us now. It is the future that becomes us now. According to Nehru, the future of the Indians was a period of dash, incessant striving. Indians have to dash to fulfill the pledges. Struggle hard. The service of India means dash. Important question. The service of the millions who suffer. The service of India means the ending of dash opportunity. Sorry, poverty, ignorance, disease, and inequality of opportunity. The greatest man of our generation is dash. Very important question. Mahatma Gandhi. Answer. The greatest man of our generation is dash. Mahatma Gandhi. The ambition of the greatest man of our generation also important. Has been uh, to wipe every tear from every eye. One regular has been to wipe every tear from every eye. We have uh, to labor and uh, work hard to dash. Give reality to our dreams. In order to give reality to our dash, we have to work hard. Give it to our dreams. Those dreams are for India, but they are also for the dash, also for the world. According to Nehru, all the nations and peoples are dash closely knit together today. Peace is said to be dash indivisible. Disaster in this one world that can no longer be split into dash isolated fragments. Nehru appeals to the people of India to join them dash with faith and confidence. Nehru opines that this is no time for dash pity and destructive criticism. This is no time for ill will or dash others blaming others. we have to build the noble mansion dash of free india 
Noble Dash of India, Noble Mansion of India. We have to build the Noble Mansion of India where all our Dash may dwell, all our children may dwell. The appointed day has come, the appointed uh, day, the day appointed by Dash, destiny. The Dash clings us to, in some measure, the past. The turning point is Dash past. According to Nehru, the appointed day has come after Dash, long slumber and struggle. Long slumber and struggle. The achievement of freedom is a fateful moment for Dash, us in India, for all Asia and for the world. A new star rises, your new star means death, freedom. Our work will not be over as long as death, there are tears and suffering. We rejoice in the freedom even though death around us, clouds around us. Nehru says that many of our people are death, sorrow stricken. According to Nehru, difficult problems death us, encompass us. Freedom brings responsibilities and death, burdens. Freedom brings responsibilities and burdens and we have to face them in the spirit of death, free and disciplined people on the Independence Day. On the Independence Day, our first thoughts go to death of this freedom, uh, architect of the freedom. The architect of our freedom was death, the father of our nation, Mahatma Gandhi. Gandhiji held a lot of death, the torch of freedom. We are death followers of Gandhiji, honor the followers of Gandhiji. We are honor the followers of Gandhiji because we have straight death from his message. Gandhiji was magnificent in his death, faith, strength, courage and humility. We shall never allow the torch of freedom to dash, to be dashed, blown out. We shall never allow the torch of freedom to be blown out, however high the wind or stormy the dash, tempest. Nehru's second thought goes to dash, the unknown volunteers and soldiers. The unknown uh, soldiers and volunteers have served India even to death without praise or dash, river. Our brothers of Imperial Christian, our brothers and sisters, refers to the dash, people of Pakistan. The people of Pakistan have been caught up from us by dash, important question, political boundaries. Nehru expects that we shall be sharers in their dash, good or ill fortune alike. We have to bring freedom and dash to the common people of India, opportunity. Nehru says that we have to bring freedom and opportunity to dash, common man, the peasants and the workers of India. Nehru says we have to fight and end dash, poverty, ignorance and disease. Nehru says we have to build up a dash, prosperous, democratic and progressive nation. Nehru says that we have to create dash to ensure justice to all, social, economic and political institutions. We have to create social, economic and political institutions to ensure dash to all, justice. There is no resting till we redeem our pledge in dash, full. Nehru says that we can take rest. Uh, before we dash, with them our place in full. Nehru opines that we are equally the children of India with equal dash, rights, privileges and obligations. We cannot encourage dash, communalism, communalism means dash, religious fanaticism. On the walls of achieving freedom, Nehru sends greetings to dash, to the people, nations and peoples of the world. According to uh, Nehru, India is dash, ancient, eternal and ever new. No nation can be great whose people are important question. No nation can be great whose people are dash, narrow-minded or narrow in thought or in action. The text is destiny ends with this joy. It's like this question chapter of filling the blanks. Our report today, comparison question was done. Now our couple did a discussion. Kariba, who is the author of the topic? Couple did Sunil Manohar Gavaskar. Who was the captain in the 1983 Prince World Cup? Couple did. Who called whom to over to discuss the team to go to East Africa? Rasing number four. What did Gavaskar remember then? Gavaskar remembered an over bowl to him by couple did earlier in the season in the Ulster Trophy. What did Gavaskar tell Kapil in the Ulster Trophy match? In the Ulster Trophy match, Gavaskar told Kapil to come closer to the storm and bowl. Kapil they had shown dash in the Ulster Trophy, enormous potential and willingness to learn. In the Ulster Trophy, Gavaskar told Kapil to come dash to the storms, closer to the storms. Gavaskar suggested Kapil to make his dash effective, out finger. A couple of players from Kapil's team rushed Gavaskar, thinking that he was using a bit of dash, came fancy. According to, the, according to Gavaskar, it is always good fun to play against dash, good bowlers. When Kapil Dev was making an effort to come closer to the storms and bowl, it was apparent that he was going to be a dash in cricket force. What does gamesmanship mean? Gamesmanship means the art of winning by using the rules to one's own advantage without actual cheating. In the in which of the match, Kapil's excellent bowling gave him dash a lot of prominence. Uh, the Indian team's two to East Africa was a dash tour, friendly to. The two youngsters were picked to get some dash experience of foreign conditions, which match brought Kapil into national focus. Ulster P match, what brought Kapil into national focus? Kapil's excellent bowling in the Ulster P match brought him into national focus. Who are the test stalwarts in the Indian cricket team before the advent of Kapil Dev? Patodi, Vishnat, Yashvinder Singh, and Eknath Sarkar. Who are two youngsters? Important question. Who are two youngsters selected for the East Africa to Kapil Devan? Shuru Naik. The cricket lovers of East Africa liked Kapil's performance very much as dash. He, had, uh, he uh, hit many a towering six. Kapil Dev was selected to play for Dias in the 11th match, the rest of India. The 11th match was played at Dias, at Bangalore. Dias was a trial game, the 11th of match. The 11th of match at Bangalore was a trial game before the team stood to Dias, Pakistan. The 11th of match, uh, in the 11th of match, Kapil scored a Dias, Hurricane 61. Even after Kapil's selection for the team to go to Pakistan, it was doubtful if he could, would Dias find a, a place in the test team. 
how did kapil found a bot for himself in the team to go to pakistan kapil found a bot for himself in the team to go to pakistan only because of his excellent bowling and batting in the iran trophy why did the selector select kapil for the pakistan tour uh, because the tour would give him a lot of prominence kapil was picked for the first test as dash and sarab faisla bad tabare what post sadik to discard his green pakistan cap kapil's bouncers important question kapil post sadik to discard his green pakistan cap for a dash for a helmet kapil scored 59 as a dash at first over Captain Ajay Knight Watchman. How did Kapil earn the tag of an all-rounder? Kapil earn the tag of an all-rounder after scoring 59 as a Knight Watchman against Pakistan at first level test. Kapil confirmed his tag of an all-rounder, scoring a century against India's West Indies. Kapil failed with the bat on the day's 1979 tour of England. Kapil Dev could not get more runs in the matches on the 1979 tour of England because of India's his eagerness to hit the ball in the air. On the 1982 tour of England, Kapil scored India's runs in the uh, in three test matches, 300 runs. During those days, Kapil was dead in the world, one of the top all-rounders. To famous all-rounder, Ian Botham belongs to dead England. Imran Khan belongs to dead Pakistan. Richard Hadley belongs to dead New Zealand. All the all-rounders described in this topic are dead attacking cricketers. Why was the entire responsibility of taking wickets on Kapil? The entire responsibility of taking wickets was on Kapil because there was no other strike bowler in the Indian team to support him. During Kapil's time, the Indian batting has not been dead consistent. When uh, when did Kapil slow shots become rare after becoming the captain? The World Test was played in London, India, 1979. On the 19 in the 1979 World Test, India drew and uh, did not win, falling short by dash runs, nine runs. There is no place for dash in cricket, ifs and buts. What was Kapil's captain's job? Very very important question. To win the Prince World Cup as a captain. Why did India lose five wickets for seven runs in the match against Zimbabwe due to good bowling and poor strokes? Kapil scored dash runs. Important question. Kapil runs uh, scored dash runs against Zimbabwe. One seven five not out. What was the record score before the World Cup nineteen in nineteen eighty three? The record score before was one seven one. Kapil bowled dash over some tight medium pace four. The game against dash was a turning point in the Prince Albert. Important question. The game against Zimbabwe. Hotel Kapil was a, uh, was set up by dash. Kapil's brothers. Kapil's success gave up, uh, encouragement and impetus to dash the youngsters. Before Kapil's advent in international cricket, there was no dash in India. Fast bowlers. Uh, in today's day and age cricket, dash is important. Speed. Uh, the youngsters inspired by Kapil would provide adequate practice to our dash batsmen. Kapil's attacking brand, uh, brand made him dash a crowd puller. Indian cricketers were called all dogs in the early dash fifties. Kapil the batter number eleven in the game against dash East Africa. The last one. Kapil the chapter one. I will discuss the discussion. Kapil the chapter one. I will discuss the discussion. Kapil the chapter one. I will discuss the discussion. Kapil the chapter one. I will discuss the discussion. Air pollution and hidden runs from the discussion. Kariba, when did the industrial accident take place at Bhopal on 3 December 1984? From where did the deadly gas escape into the atmosphere? A chemical plant operated by Union Carbide. How many local residents were killed due to the industrial accident at Bhopal? Over 4,000. How is air more important uh, for man? Because man cannot live without breathing even for a minute. Uh, how much water does an hour alone exchange a day? 2.5 kg. Which gas is the major constituent of air? Nitrogen, 78%. Uh, what is the uh, quantity of carbon dioxide in the air? Carbon dioxide 0.03. Our oxygen which is 21%. When is air said to be polluted? In the composition of air uh, is altered, uh, or the oxygen level gets reduced, or irritating gases enter the atmosphere, then the air is said to be polluted. What is the effect of inhalation of polluted air? Inhalation of polluted air can lead to respiratory dangers. What are the fuels burned in the industries? Various fuels like coal, coke, and furnace oil. Where does the smoke go? The smoke mingles with the atmospheric air. What does polluted air contain? Obnoxious gases, ash, and dust particles. Which internal parts of our body slowly become garbage dumps for the pollutants? Our lungs. Which industries discharge high amounts of smoke and ash? Thermal power stations. Which industries release toxic fumes into the air? Chemical industries. What amount of pollutants do the automobiles of Kolkata spew every day? About 1,500 tons. What do the automobiles release into the atmosphere? Carbon monoxide. Important question. Carbon monoxide. What is the effect of air pollution on flower and vegetable crops? Many flower and vegetable crops uh, are destroyed by the car exhaust gases. How have the cattle been poisoned? Cattle have been poisoned by the fumes from smelters and recover aluminium from wood. How have the trees been killed? Trees have been killed by pollution from power plants. What causes rubber tires and automobiles to crack and become porous? Air pollution. Next, uh, what health problems are caused by pollution? A polluted air, eye irritations, catchy throats, and respiratory diseases. Where, where the periods of high levels of air pollution linked to an increased number of death in the United States and uh, Europe. Now, which gases tend to trap the radiation that reaches the earth from the sun? Carbon dioxide, methane, and nitrous oxide. How many? Uh, what many? 
part may destroy the atmospheric layer chlorofluorocarbon man rakhi ba chlorofluorocarbon ba cfc what does acid rain contain oxides of important question oxides of sulfur and nitrogen how is water affected by acid rain acid rain makes the water of the lakes and uh, rivers acidic what is the impact of acid rain on soil acid rain washes or leaches away soil's nutrient content where have 4000 lakes been uh, affected due to acid rain in sweden what are soil's nutrients potassium calcium and magnesium which fish has vanished from the river of central wales the deeper fish from where has the brown trout brani uh, vanished norwegian lakes which species in sweden have been threatened by acid rain by phycocera and apple butterfly how does acid rain affect man acid rain irritates the sensitive tissues of our eyes and lungs particularly children uh, and can also cause skin lesions how are the beautiful buildings of krakow being destroyed by acidic smog where is acid rain eating into the marble of its uh, world famous monuments in athens what are uh, the basic approaches to control air pollution preventive measure dispersal measure and collection measure how can we take the preventive measures to control air pollution by changing the raw materials used in mon rakhi bhai the important question so we sector padi payo by changing the raw materials used in industry or the ingredients of fuel which is preventive measure tapar dispersal measure kemti na by raising the heights of smoke stacks tapar collection measure by designing equipment to trap pollutants before they escape into the atmosphere what do uh, all the industrialized countries have to prevent and uh, control air pollution some type of legislation uh, how are the pollutants carried from one country to another by the wind important question by the wind how has the death of lakes in eastern canada been caused by acid rain originated in the united states what have caused damage in sweden acids produced in britain and france what have brought improvements in many areas air quality program what can change important question what can change pollutants into harmless substances catalytic converter what have been made in different countries to check air pollution and ensure quality air law setting standards and norms itla air pollution a hidden menace chapter of objective questions are bartan me last chapter schools could buy schools could buy hume discussion kar daba sesa kar daba objective question schools could buy amra last chapter ithu amra madhyam ek mark ro question padibo tenu discussion kar daba who is the speaker in the essay schools could buy lord is just perceive what does the essay schools could buy tell the students the essay schools could buy tell the students to become good human beings and citizen in the future what does the speaker speak about the speaker speaks about the future welfare of the students what must people do if they are ambitious to succeed if people are ambitious to succeed they must continue their education to whom does success come success comes to those who work hard and continue learning important question to work hard and continue learning how should people choose their profession people should choose their profession with the greatest care uh, what kind of profession should people aim at people should aim at profession which will bring him or her an interesting and happy future what should you do if you are important question what should you do if you are uh, forced to take a job uh, you do not like kon kariba na you should avoid it and try to pick up one which is at your liking what should people do in case of doubts if people find themselves in doubt they should ask advice from one of the teachers what does success in life depend on success in life depends large on good health but success in life depends large on good health what harmful habits should people avoid smoking and drinking how can we keep good health by cleanliness stress and regular habits and suitable recreation and make us strong to play the game how does smoking affect us smoking stunts our body and clouds the brain man rakha smoking stunts our body and clouds the brain how does uh, drinking affect us drinking ruins our health and reduce, reduces our efficiency what is the price disposition of an individual character man rakha important question price disposition which amra character how should people keep their character character people should keep the character on turn is not free from black spot what should we be to our rivals we should be fair in front question we should be fair to our rivals what should we be to the weak and suffering we should be kind and helpful to the weak and the suffering what should we be in all things we should be all uh, we should be truthful in all things what should uh, we or uh, people stand up for people should stand up for goodness purity and nobility what is a mean game gambling is a mean game what is gambling gambling is a mean game trying is uh, trying to get something for nothing and at somebody's cost why should we make provisions we should make provisions for hard times when should we avoid idling we should avoid idling in our leisure hours how should one spend one's leisure hour important question one should spend one's leisure hours with interesting hobbies reading good books and with the companions of an association what do you mean by hard times hard time means Difficult times when the period of stress and strain may come unexpectedly. How is a person known? A person is known by the company he keeps. 
How can we achieve real success in life? We can achieve real success in life if we possess a sound mind in a sound body, a good character, courteous manners and loyalty to the duties of our nation and its high ideals. What should we avoid in leisure hours? We should avoid mere idling in leisure hours. Salame. Subject of chapter conflict or the panchot jack of projuru, both the question discussing about serious record age to me. The podicho, the lacky one crisprino, and it's the one rejo, Kiba, say video jacky, PDF kutekini, give us a video of the discussion to me. Thanks for watching. God bless you. All the best for you.